Yeah, uh, Fisher's a good guy, really nice guy. Um, I probably didn't know as, as well as uh, as I'd have liked to, but uh, we were we were two Brits in a race, and we uh, we shared the same surname, so that created a bit of a bond between us. And uh, I think because of that, when we saw each other in the race footage or on the dock or whatever, we'd always take time to to catch up and have a chat. And uh, and for that, I'm really grateful. Um, he was always very uh, enthusiastic about being in the race, and uh, yeah, it was a real reminder of uh, why, why we all do it in the first place. I think, uh, I think also, um, you know, just from his teammates, he was he was a really important part of that crew. Um, both his ability as a sailor and also his, his personality, and uh, yeah, he was really the, the soul of that team that, that held them all together. So, you know. It's, uh, you can see what a great loss it was when uh, when they lost him. So I remember I remember hearing the news and it was difficult knowing what he was going through and uh, and his team having been in a similar situation. But um, you know these guys are never forgotten. I think they're the ones that remind us to, uh, <clears throat> to love what we do. Be grateful to be out here and how lucky we are to be able to do that. So always cherish every moment with your family and your friends because, yeah, you really never know how long you got. And, uh, yeah, I think people don't fish and, and arms for me, obviously, as well. It's a little shoulder angel always telling me to look after myself, to hold on tight and, um, yeah. Every time I go sailing, I, I think I carry a little bit of those guys with me. <laughs>